here we go. Right, so we're going to look at factorising today. All right, now this is a really important skill, um, and it, it, people people get it wrong. So it, it, again, let's have a look at some some examples. So factorise the expression. So in other words, it means putting the bracket back. So what you're looking at is you're looking to see can you see anything that goes into this, and also goes into this, all right? So if I look at the numbers first, so what goes into 12 and goes into 18? So the, I want the highest number, the highest common factor. So the highest common factor is six. So that's gonna go outside the bracket. And then we're also gonna look at the letters, see if there's anything in common about the letters. In this occasion, there's, there's not, there's not. All right, there's an X, there's a Y. So there's nothing going on with the letters. So six multiplied by two is 12 so that'd be two and the x is still there and six multiplied by three and of course the y is still there and that's still going to be a negative really nice these because you can just multiply it because multiplying out is going to be a little bit easier 12x minus 18y yay it works okay done it this one so what do we got here so again, I'm looking to see what's common. So I look at the numbers first. No, there isn't a common factor there. Not, not a nice whole number. Okay, so I'm going to leave those alone. But if I look at the letters, well, that's got x squared, that's got x. So I can just factorize like that. I can take x out as a common factor. So I've still got a 3, haven't touched that number. So x times x is x squared so that goes there and still got the 2 haven't touched that and, and that's it that x has gone outside i can multiply it out 3x squared 2x brilliant done all right um I, i'm just going to write one down for you that a lot of people find difficult and it's really interesting it's virtually the same question as this um, if you write this down, this is a really weird one because it's amazing how many people struggle with this. And obviously, sometimes if you just change the letters, you know, that, that can make it a bit confusing. All right. But I just made all these X's and Y's just to make life a bit easier. Right. What happens here? That was it's virtually the same as this. The only thing that's different is two. There isn't a number there. So what's in common? X goes outside. So that's still going to be three X. But what goes here? Ah, dude, that X has gone outside. What do I write? Well, how many X's have you got? One. Okay. We don't write one, do we? So it'd be like that. Now, it's really weird, that question. Although it's like, it's actually a lot easier. But this causes confusion just here. So just be careful there when you see that one pop up. Right? You will see it pop up from time to time. Um, and the last one I'm going to do with you is this one just here. Now the only difference about this is that the numbers are going to work. Okay, so what goes into 15 and 10? Well, 5 does, yeah. So 5 is going to go outside. All right. Now sometimes when I'm a little bit unsure, I just I write down what I know. Right. I know I'm going to take something outside and then there's going to be a bracket there. So let's just fill that information in. Right. Now I'm going to look at the letters. This time x is in both okay so it's numbers going to go outside and letters can go outside the bracket so what could go outside x there we go so what's left inside well 5 multiplied by 3 is 15 there we are. and i've only taken 1xx so x times x is x squared so that's 15x squared so that first bit works i've got a minus okay because that's going to be that bit and then 5 times 2, so that x is over there, so it's just left with a y. Hurrah! There we go. That's some common factors, okay? Just a bit of factorising there for you, okay? So, as usual, go and practice some questions, please.
enjoyed that video, please like and subscribe or leave a comment down below. Thanks for watching. I've been RMS Maths and I'll see you next time. Maths out.